The latest now on a developing story as federal investigators are set to arrive this morning at the site of a deadly plane crash in Owasso. Two News reporter Patricia Santos live with more on what we know about the crash so far. Patricia? Well, that plane crash site is right behind me here. We're located off of 98th Street North, uh, just about half a mile east of Memorial uh, near Owasso. This plane went down around 345 yesterday, and this morning NTSB officials will arrive here at the crash site. Now, there has been a lot of speculation about who the victim is, but until investigators release the name and the family has been properly notified, we will not be releasing a name. Now, take a look. You can see emergency crews there guarding the crash site. We know the plane left from Salina, Kansas, headed to Tulsa yesterday afternoon. Now, this involves a Mitsubishi MU2 small engine uh, plane. A spokesperson for Tulsa International Airport says the pilot alerted air traffic control of a mechanical problem. He reported that uh, he needed to land immediately. A pilot who was also on the air at the time says he heard chatter on the radio and minutes later he flew over the wreckage. And so we flew when, as we banked, we could see what, like I said, what I know now to be the wreckage. And we were all wondering, is that a wildfire or are people out burning leaves or is it, is it, you know, the wreckage of the plane? There were probably 12, maybe 10 to 12 distinct little pods of, of smoke, um, not much fire. Now, that pilot uh, telling us that he was overcome with grief as uh, he knows that uh, tragedies like this can happen. Now, we have put in multiple calls to federal investigators involved in this um, investigation here, and uh, we're waiting for their calls. But uh, we're going to stay out here this morning as investigators arrive as they try to figure out what caused this crash. Live in Owasso, Patricia Santos, 2 News, works for you.